And this this particular section, she's talking about the press pass. And after she, after I play this, or maybe even during, I'm going to pull out my special surprise for everyone. <laughs> I thought I, I thought we discussed this toast. You're not supposed to show that to everybody. That's just between us. I thought I can show my bullhorn to everyone. <laughs> Your special surprise. That's between us. Like we talked about the crust. Do we need to see our therapist again? <laughs> Fine, fine. This is like um, the, the reason why I did it this way is because yeah. obviously with the other locales they always lie, right? Yeah. And so I never show what exactly receipt like what receipts I'm going to show until I get into the stream because I want them to lie, try to retcon. And that's exactly what she does in this <clears> clip. <throat> she completely makes up a story, and you'll see what I mean. Um, Moscow 101. Moscow 101. Yeah. You know the book. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And of course, it's so funny because I do a lot of things strategically. I really do. I do a lot of things strategically, as many of you guys know. And one of the things that I do is show how ridiculous some of these creators are. You know, their hate is, is absolutely insane. It really is. <laughs> but she's but not bothered. And, but we don't hate her. That's what's really No. Funny. Guys, yeah. it's a drama-free zone. Look at our screen. It's, it's I, I don't hate zone. you, Betty. I don't hate you. Yeah, don't nah, hate I don't hate her either. <laughs> At the end of the day, I have, been, I have been explaining the laws on press, you know, the constitutional rights of press, the freedom of press, all these other things. You know, they come out forever, ever, 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 amen, saying, oh, she's not, she's, not this, she's not that. Like, yes, 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 press, yes, I am. Yes. And I even said what as far as to say, you know, everybody pretty much that covers true crime or any type of news is, is considered press. When you reach out and get paperwork and you bring it to an audience, that's you doing work. That's no, man. And I had a criminal lawyer on my stream oh, discussing my this. No, you can't just say I'm press. There are certain regulations and ethics and uh, like almost like TOS that you have to abide by. Right. Yes. So, you know, I was with another company for the app for the simple, um, you know, aspect that there was a lot of people oh. in that particular company and everything like that. Oh. Well, since then, I'm like, no, I don't need to do that. Oh. And I don't need to pay these fees because what oh. we do here is exactly that. Oh, so really? I decided to go ahead and roll out. And many of you guys know we did. She's got a pile of them. She's got... <laughs> Why would she need more than one? I don't understand. Okay, guys. Okay. <laughs> the moment has arrived. So, thank you, Calamity Jade. I appreciate that. Uh, yes, Calamity Jade. Thank you. <laughs> I had to. I had to pause not only to check my euros that I'm cooking, but I had to get more whiskey. I couldn't stop laughing at the one press pass. <laughs> oh my god. So. Her new retcon, because she saw what I was going to go live about, and she almost like hit point by point with what I had said in my stream last night. And so now she's trying to say, oh, well, I, I, it was, I cut ties with them because I didn't want to pay the fee and I didn't want to deal with that. So I just made my own, right? Um, <laughs> receipts, receipts. So this is what it says on the website. <laughs> Press past credentials revoked. Revoked. That means and I can take give it from you, your ass. I can give you the link to the website and you can look it up for yourself. I'll oh, post that in the description. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh but it gets better, guys. Because Betty. somebody mm. sent this to me like a month ago because apparently... Um, Hang on, I have to look at a link I sent. I sent you back. <sighs> so somebody sent this to me a month ago because apparently the press corps have been investigating you for quite some time. And let me just be very, very clear. They did not look at my channel. They did not look at clip channels. They looked at your channel, Betty. They they watched your streams, your videos, your content. So this your is what harassment, the harassment, your yelling, your irrational behavior, your insane the, uh... antics. So this is this is part of an email. I cut a lot of it off because um, the person who made the formal complaint, I cut their information out. There was some other things I had to read back that had people's personal information in it. So this is what the director, the founding director of Press Corps says, quote, members of the press have to obey laws just like everyone else. We have published hundreds of times in the last 38 years that law enforcement is in charge at all times, period. <laughs> Their instructions are to be fully followed at all times, no questions asked. We fully support the law enforcement uh, taking her press badge and notifying us. Yes. So basically, if you don't mind me taking this, when she sure. showed up, to the press conference and was denied entry, she was reported Correct. by law enforcement. Correct. Right. <laughs> Correct. So if you're gonna be mad at somebody, be mad at the Georgia police, be mad at yourself because you're the one who put yourself in this situation. Totally. So there was somebody's personal information and they said, thank you for caring about the rights of your community and reporting abuse. Feel free to quietly, re quietly forward this email to the quote, kind officer or his superiors. And what she's referencing here is that video on Bullhorn Betty's channel where she's belittling an officer and she's screaming, I'm part of the ACLU, da, 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 and she's right. screaming at him. Yeah, I saw that where she said the ACLU agreement. That dude was like, I don't even know what the ACLU is, bro. Like, yeah. I just need you to shut up. 
up. Right. <laughs> yeah. So they were thoroughly embarrassed by that as well. And they said, we will be happy to work with them in any way possible. We can be reached and they give a phone number and an email. Please let me know if and when you do. They say, uh, the founding director, by the way, says, I wow. apologize that one of our 90 million member, 90,000 members has blemished our name and violated the civility of our community. Our mission is to educate and encourage freelance photographers and journalists who work under the uspresscorps.org umbrella to learn and succeed as respected members of the media. Best regards, Vonda H. Blackburn, founding member. Yeah, so founding director. Founding director. So wow. this is why she got her press pass revoked yes. is because she apparently was reported when she was down in there in Georgia and they have been looking into her for weeks now and they were sent Bullhorn Betty's link to her channel. I repeat, okay. they looked at Bullhorn Betty's content, yep. her own content. Yeah. Not her haters, no. quote unquote. I mean, they just don't go by that. Look, <laughs> anyway, here's, here's... so I knew she was going to lie. So I didn't tell anybody that I had um, part of this. And there, I have, I actually have multiple emails, by the way. Yeah. But there's, they, yeah. there's so much personal information and conversations taking place that somebody sent me. I didn't, I couldn't show those. But yeah. I have been sitting right. on this email for quite some time, and it was just a matter of time. And by the way, I knew the exact day that she was going to be getting notified that her press pass was going to be revoked. And yes, <laughs> she was notified by the company. <laughs> wow. wow. Yep. Yep. Yeah, so we're so, not we're not breaking the news story here. We are, no, yeah. He knew weeks ago. That's why I've been I've been sitting on this, and I I didn't even want to be the first person. So as soon as I saw people on Twitter posting screenshots because other people started finding it on the website, yeah, I was like, okay, everybody's posting it now. Now I'm going to show this, right. and I got permission yeah. from the person who sent it to me. Okay, if I redact some of the information and crop it out, can I show yeah. it? And they said yes. Nice, nice. Ah, oh, Betty, Betty, Betty. Well, yeah. So if she claims that she chose to leave, that's not true. They kicked her out. Yeah. <laughs> These people don't give their audience the truth. They lie about everything. So anyways, and, and guess who okay. else is bored? Pause right there for Pause real quick. Uh, no, like we show receipts. Yeah. That's what we do. What we do, we don't lie about anything because that would, that would imply that we don't actually show your content of you saying things. That's what we do. We show you mm -hmm. saying things. How can we be lying when it's you talking? That's <laughs> you making an ass of yourself on YouTube constantly like literally like you could just like click on her channel when she's live and it's just easy to point out anything the is going to be rolling out and that's going to be another place that you can submit um you know because everybody what, what makes this this i love the pens in her shirt like she's so important she's, she's gotta have a backup cool in case up. the first one stops working her background looks like the office of a private detective who's going through a divorce <laughs> like, <laughs> yes, like why am i why am i here people <laughs> let me tell you the story just like any story is about <laughs> <named Betty. laughs> I remember the day Betty walked into my door. <laughs> I should have made this thirsty, black and white. Yes, this thirsty tall, than Drew Barrymore to Grunge Club. Yeah. <laughs> this tall, oozing, drink a rancid milk. <laughs> Treated me better than that bitch. <laughs> said, Monty, I need your help. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> P P I T V P I narration there. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> yeah, Alabis, where's the lo-fi jazz? <laughs> yeah, like a faint saxophone yeah. playing. You, you get the saxophone, I'll make up a story at the end of the day. There you go. <laughs> Metal blinds with fog outside. Yes, yes, I'll switch to my phone and I'll go sit outside in the dark and smoke a cigarette and tell a story to end it. There you go, you find the music. <laughs> Yada, 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 you know, getting uh, in contact and things of that nature. We've also got uh, some other things that will be rolling out in 2023 um, for the Bullhorn Betty channel and the Bullhorn Betty brand um, that I'm not going to really be talking about, but it's going to be, um, it's going to be nice. And it's going to be something that I think a lot of the audience can get involved in as well. So it, it'll be kind of cool. It's going to be cool. I promise you, you guys will not be disappointed. 2023 is going to be a big year nice. uh, for Bullhorn Betty nice. channel uh, for me, for Chronicles of Olivia, um, for our whole team of... Uh, Who's your team, Betty? Who's your team? Um, yep. You know, at Heels in the Air. Or Heels in the Air. Oh, yeah. Holla! Heels in the Air. You have betrayed us. Yes, Got him. Yeah, all right. Oh, yeah. you're in her head, Renfrey. Welcome. Yeah. We can be roomies. Yeah. The, the channel fuels in the air is fun, and the thought of fuels in the air. It's pretty yeah. fun, too. <laughs> roomies. Of course, naturally. <laughs> can be everyone this morning. But um, anyways, I just want to say that there's going to be a lot of things coming out and rolling out. I hate her mug. Here in the near future. Her mug is appropriately made like, by a woman named Karen. Yeah, her face? Or her I knew it. Were you talking about? I was just going to say it was a Karen mug. <laughs> oh, my God. I swear to God, I was just about to say it was a Karen mug. <laughs> 